Hello everyone and welcome back to Corona's Place Persona 5. Today, Alex is in the bathroom, but we also gotta go to sleep because we can't really do anything else. I heard of the bakery from the Ginza line is selling stuff limited time. Oh, okay. Should probably go check that out. Yeah, so we have to go to sleep. Sadly, we can't call Becky and have us give her give us our night back. But that's fine. I mean, what's what's one missed day? Probably very important, really, but you know. At least we're done with the palace. That, that's something, right? Though, Utaba is sleeping now. So, I'm assuming it's going to be like the other palaces that nothing's going to happen until the deadline. Who wants to hang out? This one's tough. This one's a bit difficult. There's been some uh, strange happenings in the back alley off of Shibuya Central Street. Apparently some people have been finding dead or her cats. Oh, fuck off. Can we, can we just like beat this guy to a pulp and leave him in prison or something. We don't have to change his heart. I just want to kind of make him suffer. It happens so often, people are starting to think someone might be abusing them. You think? That's unforgivable. Yeah, only the scum of the earth would take their aggression out on a weak, innocent animal. You're not wrong. Anyways, there's only so much info I've been able to get from the forum. If you're worried about this, I think you'll need to go investigate yourself. Maybe some of the employees down on Central Street would know more details about it. <clears throat> uh, this is absolutely inexcusable. I mean, not because I'm a cat or anything, it's just a cool thing to do. And if you work on Central Street, maybe you could learn more from your peers. So I was told there are going to be mementos quests unlocking soon that I have to work at my jobs a few times to get uh, available. Which is totally fine. And awesome, I'm glad I have nutrients. Level up kindness. No. Well. All right. That's fine. I guess. Maybe. Uh, what am I doing? I think I want to go to the airsoft airsoft shop place. Kind of want to go to the map. Thank you. I keep pressing the wrong button. Let's see. We got on his max. Ryuji is gonna call us or something. You got nothing. Okay, so Makoto's the only one. That's fine. Uh, before we go visit her, and I guess it's just going to be a generic hangout, huh? So I guess I'll just meet you in the evening time? Did I say we would meet at night? No, I lied. We're actually going to make this Nico Sojin. Or Sogun, excuse me. Uh, invigorate, what's that? Automatic... Ooh. Right! Is that... That's like the uh, the SB adhesive things. That's dope. Yeah, you're gonna gain like two levels, I guess. Okay, that's fine. Uh, what are we gonna give? Um, I guess Lucky Punch for crits. And you don't have the skill I need because I think I have to actually strengthen you, which is fine. Let's do. The group one. Receive a fraction now for a rebirth. I like group more because it's just like we we usually run into multiple enemies of the same like weakness types. I'm Nico Sojin or Shogun. I don't know why I keep mispronouncing it. Yes, yeah, so I think I need to strengthen you in order to get the thing I need. Yeah, well, I guess I'll do that. Dring them up. Do not expect. This is the power. Let these powers unite. There we go. All right, that's what I needed. Uh, I actually should go over the some of the um. The personas that I fused together trying to make room. Um, yeah, I got this lady now. She can't, seems kind of dope. Go to stats. Uh, yeah, she seems kind of dope. Uh, you we've had. You we've had. You're going away soon. You we've had. And this guy. And I think... Oh, yeah, and uh, Starro from the DC Universe place. And then the, the Nico Shogun. This is what we need, I think. Hey, yeah! It would seem. I can sense it within you. 
uh, Nikyo Soj uh, Sh Shogun with Dekaja. Hmm. hmm. You're really getting the hang of this whole growth thing. <sighs> Dots. What's wrong, Justine? It's nothing vital. However, presiding over the growth of another feels almost nostalgic in a way. Do you feel the same, Caroline? What do you mean? We've never taken care of someone like this before. You are not wrong about that. And yet our duty to aid his rehabilitation as aside, observing his growth feels oddly familiar. Excuse me? That can't be right. The inmate's growth and this rehabilit uh, rehabilitation are the exact same thing. Hey, inmate. Hey, inmate. The growth you're getting from these tasks is helping you with your re rehabilitation, right? I, I mean, probably? See, Justine, they're the same. Is that not something we should judge for ourselves, though? Anyway, Justine, don't forget about our job. The duty we've been hand handed is all that matters. Don't think about anything else. Just be a cog in the machine, Justine. I suppose you're correct. <sighs> Sigh. I guess you're gonna keep worrying about this till the inmate finishes his rehabilitation, huh, Justine? Looks, look like, uh, look what you've done, inmate. Getting all of us wrapped up in your fate. Ugh. Gas? Could it be? What's up? Nothing. But I believe I'm beginning to look forward to seeing whether the inmate can complete his task. You heard her. Don't disappoint us, inmate. Okay. Do I get anything for this, or do I have to, like, was it three more times or two more times? Ooh. We're probably... All right. I can check. I can check their confidant thing. Okay, on to the next task. Justine? Just stares blankly at you. What is the next task? Farewell. Ah, yes. Here's a second task you must fulfill before receiving your reward. Oh, okay. One more. Shit. Okay. Shit. Do I know anyone with that skill? That's not the skill. I have to know someone in the registry that knows that skill, and then I can just sacrifice and strengthen her. Yeah? Gonna string them up? Hmm. This is a let these powers unite. Come on. Come on. Let's do this. Okay. Yep, ice. See, it's like four times now. No, we want to replace. No, we want to replace that one. There. there you go. That's it, right? Let's fuck the list. There. Yeah, that's it. All right. Great. Holy crap. Um. Shit. What do I get rid? of? Yeah, this one, because I don't care about that. I really should, probably, but I have items. Hoi! Finished. Yeah, no, I don't want to head back. I want you guys to berate me again, because for some reason, I put up with it. Hey. I mean, I guess I'm locked in a cage. Hey! It would seem. I see you brought us the, the personas that we wanted. <laughs> Looks like you're getting the hang of this. Well, that's another assignment down. Hi, right, maybe I can do the next one. All right, let's keep moving to the next task before things get all messy like last time. No difficult questions, Justine. Just give him his assignment. Yes. Understood. Huh? What? What's with you? You're no, not usually this cooperative. I was going to say, there's no way that's happening. I have no intention of abandoning my duty, but I would like to know the truth of the situation. After all, we possess a mysterious list which seems to have foretold the current state of affairs. Who wrote it? Why do I recognize the membership? Why does observing growth feel nostalgic? And beyond that... What was the true intent of this of its creator? Yeah. I thought I said no difficult questions. To be honest, though, I have arrived at a, hypo a hypothesis. What? what? You know the answer? No, she has a hypothesis. We manage the inmate's power via several arcana, which symbolize the mystic nature of this world. In truth, the encounter we share with him is represented by the strength arcana. Strength represents great power, a mighty will, and the awakening of the unknown. Sounds about right. Caroline, 
In our interactions, have has the inmate been the only one to have had something awaken within him? Perhaps therein lies the answer. What's that supposed to mean? Ah, oh, damn it! Why do I feel so weird? Uh, do I get my reward now? Sh sh shut up, inmate! Can't you see we're in the middle of something? And we already told you there's three tasks you got to do before. Oh, you lied to me last time. Hmm. Although the next task is going to be the eighth one. There ain't aren't too many left on the list. Uh, you come this far, inmate, and I hope you see it through. I mean, that's the plan. If you do this, the answer will surely become clear. And uh, you're more than just some random schmuck to us now. You're the, only, you're the only one who can find the answer we're looking for. You got that, inmate? I thought you were gonna say we were friends, but fine. That's fine. I can just be like your answer, I guess. All right. Kind of an asshole, but I get. I, like, but you know, that's, that's completely fine. Up, inmate. Okay. Uh, next, you're gonna bring us one more persona before we, you get another reward. Yeah, but I want my reward now. I'm impatient. Uh, Jesus. I'm not even gonna try that. We're gonna call him Hecto. Okay. I haven't seen that name, though, so... In the future? I think I need to buy Isis again. Anyways, I'll meet you guys at night. You'd like... Hey, is Fatuba... Uh, Fatuba, huh? Fataba, still asleep? It's been a whole day already. You're way too impatient. Calm down. We just have to wait. I go ways. Yes, let us drink some tea and calm our minds. Oh, and some rice crackers with the tea would be lovely as well. What? I am most certainly in the mood. Anyway, we should wait until a uh, wait a little longer before for top of the wake up. Or some for something salty today. I understand why you guys don't feel nervous, but we'll just have to wait for now. For ten more days? Oh, it's Thursday. Okay. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do him because he's usually only available on Sunday. So I'm feeling like that's uh. Oh no, no. Respond later. Sorry. You you get hanged out with him when no one else is available except for that. Oh yeah, lady. Um. Okay. Let me try calling Becky. Yes, call her. Ah damn it, Becky. Uh, yeah, and you want to hang out? No, I mean Normally I would but Why are you contacting me on a Thursday? I have something planned after my speech today. I'd like your help with both. Are you available today? Yes Because this is odd usually usually only available on like Sunday So I feel like this is something special or at least this is his next part of his rank I guess uh, thank you through this diet man met Sushita has been asking for me uh, Remember when he asked to be his right-hand man last time. He's likely waiting for my response. Well, then please join me after my speech Sure Oh, we're beating a shady alley. Oh, that's great What did you ask to ask me here to discuss? He's gonna kill us. I Heard you met with uh, Kuramoto's grandson You have your ears, ears to the ground, huh? And to think that he's the candidate the party is backing to ruin my chances of winning. I'll be completely straight with you, since I already asked you to be my right-hand man. We're currently fighting the Kura Kuramato group. What? You're fighting with Mr. Kuramato? I have ambitions of my own, you know. I owe him for all the all he did for me, but I still want him to have inf I still don't want him to have influence over me forever. All the more now that he's a, a secretly working with diet members from other parties. I know he asked you to join his group, but I think you should decline his offer. Mm. Thoughts. They want to keep you on a lease so you won't reveal any damaging information. The real culprit of the expense appropriations case you were blamed for is old man Kuramato. What in the world? What did you just say? He ser I searched the paper uh, party's off records accounts from 20 years ago. There's no doubt. You can s can you still forgive him? He led you into the political world and kicked you out of it in the worst way. But why? Seems he bought his popularity, and as a result, he was having trouble, uh, having some financial troubles. I see. It sounds as if you were saying, if, if, it sounds as if you're saying that this is my opportunity to clear my name. And so you need an answer for me on whether or not I'll be your right-hand man, yes? 
His own grandson has already tried to persuade you, therefore I can't wait any longer. If you join me, you can accuse Kuramato of his crimes. And you can clear your name and put no good Tor behind you. This is your best and last chance. Join with Matsushita and take my revenge against Mr. Kuramoto, uh, Kuramoto and drop out of the election. Uh, don't do it. I mean, he can make his own choice. I, I, it's If that's accurate, that's a tempting choice, really. I'd probably take it, to be quite honest with you. Are you going to do it? It's a good deal, if I think about the future, however... Matsushita. I appreciate the offer, but I must refuse. You have no conceivable reason to refuse! My goal is to become a member of the Diet, not a right-hand man. I will not cast aside my beliefs. On that I stand firm. This information would be the deciding factor in taking down Kuramoto. Kuramoto. I'm sorry. Don't worry about it. I was simply offering you a deal. I assumed you might decline it. Very well, please forget about it. I apologize for bringing it up so suddenly. I'll talk to the party and provide support on your next speech at th about the Phantom Thieves. Why are you doing this? I don't want to be- I don't want to debate about the Phantom Thieves. I simply want to draw attention to them. And you can assert your innocence there on the Grand Stage. To be frank, I'll be happy as long as the Kuramoto group influence diminishes. No, Kun, don't speak a word of this to anyone, for both of our sakes. Oh, I wasn't paying attention, don't worry. Very well, then. It feels like I'm caught in the crossfire of a political conspiracy. My friend is trying to take advantage of me while my former mentor is trying to win me over. To achieve my dream, I must- I have to set aside my beliefs. What should I do? Stick to your beliefs? You're right. Betraying myself would be would mean betraying my supporters, which means betraying you. For some reason, just talking with you always helps me make up my mind. It's as if, it's as if my heart is being manipulated. Perhaps. If the Phantom Thieves truly do exist, then I'm sure they're very much like you. For some reason, you stood by me, no good Torah, who didn't have any supporters. Actually. I've been thinking about this for a while, actually. You must have experienced cruelty and injustice in this life. I can tell by the look in your eye. That's why I sense your desire to help the weak. And the strength to stand up to the hecklers, to Matsushita and to Kuramoto's grandson. You're no ordinary high school student. Even I know that much. Hey. Would you care to talk about it? What good would that- eh. So what if you're right? It doesn't change anything, it's true. Dot. Just a joke. <laughs> Sorry, I crossed the line there. I've always lacked restraint in these situations. See what I did there? I relieved the tension by making fun of myself. And think of it as an advanced technique for winning people over. It's like making videos for YouTube. Wow, we're already up to rank 8 with you? Mind control occasionally lets you skip negotiation. Oh, yeah! All right. Oh, yeah! Macho man skipping negotiations! All right, then. Well, I'll at least make good use of Matsushita's help get setting up the next speech. I feel like I'll be able to fully express my beliefs if you're there with me. I shall ask we can discuss it enough. again at the speech. Hmm, my charm has gone up. Lovely. I don't know how. Oh! Wait, is charismatic- is that the doctor rank? All right. Oh, well, we gonna I'll get us again. some doctor in, I think. I do need a death persona if that's the case. Yeah, I think I, think I got rid of my death persona when I was uh, doing the fusion, ha? Huh? Trying to uh, make room. Why are there maids just out in the street? Is there an. Oh, wait, is that the club area? Okay, that's the club area. I like the I like the summer break here out of school. It's nice. Allows me to do well, not more stuff, but stuff. Why would you eat curry for breakfast? I want to see your face. Oh yeah, I'm like. Okay, there's something I think I should tell you, but I can't make up my mind. Sorry, never mind. Forget I said it. Uh, meeting now. Maybe I should respond later. Thank you. I need to get my persona. Hey. 
Today's your day off. You're gonna go somewhere. Oh, make sure you eat your curry before it gets cold. Do you have cereal? You got an invitation, an invitation to go out. Let's reply once we finish eating. I will reply after I go to the velvet room, get a death persona, and then I'll go hit up the doctor. I'll just double check, like... Is Yusuke... There's nothing else I can do. All right, there's nothing else I can do. I'm gonna go get my death persona and we're gonna go hang out with Doc. What happens if I answer my text thing here? Huh, nothing. Hi girl, what's up? I'm not gonna pass out, don't worry about that. Yes, I saw your message. Let's do a clinical trial. We could go get lunch or tea or maybe ride a boat. Dots. Takimi is depressed. My overflowing charm melted Takimi's stubborn heart. I, I need to talk to you. Since this time might be the last time. Oh yeah, I don't believe that. I mean, it better not be. You sell me good stuff. Yes, yeah, so let's hang out with her. Please head to the exam room. Hey. Hey. I'm thinking of resigning. Several of my suppliers have started stated that they're going to stop selling to me. If I can't get my hands on medical supplies, I won't be able to get what I need to complete the new medicine. They're probably being pressured by Oyamata to stop doing business with me, so I figure it's over. What about Miwachin? Are you okay with this? It's fine. I confirm with the hospital, uh... With the hospital Miwa Chan was being treated at. Oh yeah, Mada was telling the truth. Uh, Miwa Chan was apparently smiling until the very end. She probably didn't want to worry anyone. I wish I could have cured her. I don't want to fame I don't want fame or money. All I wanted was to keep her smiling. This isn't about her though. I was willing to help every single person who was suffering from that disease. Then why give up? I was a sickly child when I was young too. I was always in the hospital and was really well enough to attend school at all. Medicine was all that kept me alive. That's why I wanted to become a doctor. So I could save people just like I was saved. Dots. <sighs> but I guess this is where it ends now. The medical industry is a business after all and the chief decides what's best for it. I'm all out of allies. I'm your ally. I see. Yeah, you're right. You might just be my one and only. I really appreciate everything you've done. My practice increased thanks to your uh, nosiness, and in the end, I felt like a good doctor again. So, thank you. And your patience? There are plenty of other small town doctors. This is where it ends, although it frustrates me. I can't do clinical trials anymore, so you can go home. Thanks again for all your help, and good luck with those entrance exams. What interest exams? <laughs> I know it's that, that's what we lied to her about. Is there anything I can do for Takimi? Bye. Uh, yeah. What's his full name though? What are you trying to do? You mean Oyamata? Why? I hope you're not planning to get revenge for me. <laughs> it's for my research. You're such a weird kid. That's an understatement. His full name is Soichi. Soichi, maybe? Yeah. Oh yeah, Mada. He's a very influential chief of medicine in the world of medicine. Is that all? I need to do something about the target for Takimi. All right. Take care. So we're not gonna. Ah, fuck. We're not gonna do that right away. I want to get. Because I got like three, two requests that I have to investigate for mementos. But I figure I should do those first, which will require me actually working at the jobs. Uh. Oh yeah, okay, I'm like, I'm like, what the hell are you talking about, dog? Yeah, I'll help you. Sure. Ooh, wait. I don't know. Do I have a chariot card? I think I have a chariot card. 
I hope I do. If I don't, fuck. All right. We're just gonna go there, right? Okay. Oh, Becky wasn't trying to get a hold of me, because if she was, darn it. The teacher who's with me, with him, has shit on me, too. Sorry, but I'm gonna be hiding in the bathroom. Please, Alex, just leave your phone on so I can hear what they're saying. Wow, you're really holding your liquor, Yamuchi. Hmm, I've had some experience. Some might say I'm even an alcoholic. Back in my college days, we'd rent a yacht on the, for the weekend and have massive parties. I must say, though, the sake's been tasting particularly sweet today, or lately. No surprise there. Things have been much calmer without Kamoshida. There were some real dark times in Sujin, though, right? Uh, but now that they're gone, you finally get the chance you deserve, Yamauchi. Don't flatter me. Ha ha ha. Keep flattering me. I like it. He had his strength, sure, but because of him, our volleyball team will be forever scarred. The only real option now is to abandon it completely. There well, has to be some way to bring Shujin back from into the limelight, though. That's where I come in. You mean the tra with the track team, right? The students who went through so much hardship on the Kamashi to rise again with a caring new advisor. It'll be the rebirth of a team that found themselves in the depths of despair. The public will love it. Despite my lack of track and field knowledge, I'll form a tight bond with the students. I'll be their protagonist of I'll be the protagonist of my very own tearjerker. And of course all the praise for reviving them will go to me. Their incredibly incredible loving advisor. I'll have to hire a great coach if I want to pull this off though. So you're gonna pretend to coach him while someone else does all the legwork? Amazing, Amuchi! Such stunning achievements will work great when it's time to hand out bonuses. Uh, but I'm not gonna stop there either. I'm publishing a book. Give motivational speeches. I'll, I'll publish a book. Not I am publishing a book. Uh, what about all the troublemakers on the team? I heard that uh, Naka kid is especially bad. Na yeah, Naka. Oh, you mean the one who asked them to bring in the pre Kamashita coach back? The bring of Ask them to bring the com pre commercial book coach back. Don't worry, I'll, I've already taken care of him. There's this other boy on the team, uh, Takeshi. Uh, Takeshi uh, doesn't really excel in much of anything. Well, I said I would make him the new captain if he get ri uh, get rid of that troublemaker. I might have mentioned something about how Naka was working with Kamashita too, subtly, of course. And what ended up happening? Apparently, Takeshi chased them away. The plan worked perfectly. And the best part is, not only are Takeshi's parents loaded, but his mother's the president of the PTA. I see, he'd make a great pawn. Perhaps, but uh, nothing like him could never captain a successful ca uh, champion winning, championship winning team. He may have had an unfortunate accident at practice one day, but until then, he could show the others a valuable, uh, the value of obedience. <laughs> You're incredible. Man. Every adult in this game, except for like Sujiro and the ones I'm dating, are fucking awful. And Evan, asshole. If we don't do something quick, Yamauchi's gonna get rid of Takeshi too. God damn it. Uh. Should we change his heart? I really wanna. But that's probably just messed up the track team's comeback. I don't wanna cause them any more problems. So they're just gonna have to decide on their own. You know, track ain't a team sport, at least sprinting wasn't. You've got teammates, sure, but you're really just looking out for your own time. Uh, that's why I never thought about asking people for help or trying to solve our problems together. But I can't ignore the stuff they're going through now. I mean, even though we had our own goals and shit, we're still running together. They suffered because of me, gritted their teeth with me, or suffered with me, gritted their teeth with me. Honestly, I think it was only because of them I was able to run at all. So I can't just go and turn my back on them now, right? I know they ain't the coolest thing, that ain't the coolest thing to say, but it's how I feel. I think it's cool, Ryuji. Huh? Yeah. For real? Thanks, man! I like his, like, bright-eyed, like, oh my god expression. Instant kill! A chance to instantly win a battle after a successful in ambush. All right. An must have that. We actually didn't proc that at all during the uh, palace. I guess we have another chance now. Right. Anyways, I'm starving. Let's eat some uh, moja and manja while we're here. Right now, all I've seen of this place is a goddamn toilet. <laughs> I mean, fair enough. I hope we recorded all that, because I don't think they would believe us if we just tell them that. Ring, 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 a banana phone. 
Please be backy. Oh, yeah, you just... Yeah, you just want to come out and, and leech off us because it's hot out? That's fine. I mean, I'm probably not going to hang out with you, maybe? Well, we'll see who's available. Because I want to get... I want to work those those uh, jobs to get those mementos quests. I think it's the bar and uh, you know the flower shop. Someone told me that I have to do. Let's quickly look at our map. Nothing there. We got Yusuke who wants to level up. Makoto who wants to level up. I can work at the. Flower shop in there in the bar at night. Hmm. Well, I'll have to decide that next time. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press like below. If you're not subscribed yet, when you head to my video section, check out some of the content and see if it's true you like. And once again, thank you for watching. I hope you all have a great day.